welcome back to my channel as you can tell by the title today i'll be giving you a sneak peek of what's in my track bag i decided to do this video because it is a new year and the new season is approaching so indoor training of practice should be going on right now but i just thought i would do this video because y'all seem to really love my track videos and always ask me like track questions so i decided that i would just show y'all what's in my bag and maybe give you ideas of what to have in your bag as of right now my bag is packed for a meet day but i can give y'all like examples of what would be in my bag for like practice or anything else but right now it's prepped for meet day but let's get into the video so first i'm going to start with this little pocket right here on the side you probably can't even see it but it's like a little small compartment and as of right now i just have some hand lotion and some hand sanitizer in there normally i will have my airpods in there but i lost them so they're not in there next on the side right here is a water bottle holder and we have just some dasani water in there or i would have a sports drink like gatorade body armor powerade anything with electrolytes in it on the side right here moving on we're gonna go to the front part pocket right here since it's just right here and then we're gonna go into the big compartment inside this big compartment is my spikes so don't mind how dirty my bag is it's just what happens when you're track at me so these are my spikes they are neon yellow and they have the blue on the bottom don't mind how dirty they are and the missing spot spikes on the bottom these are the nike zoom superfly elite threes i'm pretty sure but they come in pink and this neon color i end up getting both but as of right now i'm using my neon ones and i love them so much they cost around like 130 to 150 i'm pretty sure but I really would recommend these if you are looking for some new spikes. I'd recommend these. And they also fit my insults in the inside because I'm flat footed. So I got to put inserts inside of my shoes. But yeah, I love these. I really recommend them. Also in my spike bag, I have my key for spikes and some extra spikes in there. Now moving on to the big compartment at the top. Y'all probably wondering what is all this stuff that is on the like hook right here. This is a tag that has my name on it and the school that I go to and it matches like my school colors. These are bag check bands from Texas Relays and y'all probably wondering like girl why didn't you do a Texas Relay video when you went last year and that's because I brought my camera but I freaking forgot my battery charging at home. So I couldn't even make the video but I took lots of pictures and videos on my phone but this year I got y'all I'm gonna do a vlog it's from Texas Relays and I got this keychain at Texas Relays too it has the little longhorn symbol on it and it's just like a little keychain and I keep those up there for motivation and just for keepsake but let's jump into this big compartment first thing on top is my warm-up shirt this is what it looks like it says one team one speed on it and then my school on it don't want to hold that up for too long and we have my warm-up suit this is the top part of it so this is what it looks like it has my school logo on it and then it has a hood and then the logo on the back of the pants to it this is what they look like it says vikings on the side and then they're just navy with the little columbia like sides on it next we have my uniform so this is the top part has my school logo on it and then it says vikings down the back with the school logo and i'm not gonna lie y'all i freaking love these uniforms because they're so like breathable you can see it has holes in the back can y'all see that has little holes in the back and it's tight but it's like not too tight where it's like uncomfortable but it's stretchy too like i love it and in the bottoms these are actually kind of volleyball shorts but they have our logos on the side and so they look like they're pretty short but hey at least they still cover a little bit because you know in college they wear the buns and the panties so next i see on top is my headphones can't go nowhere without these wear these when i'm trying to get locked in when i'm warming up 
Just when I'm in my zone, put these on, can't hear nothing, just focused and locked in. So I got these four. Then we have my running shoes, my warm-up shoes, practice shoes, whatever you want to call them. Here they are. I just got these. These are some new shoes. I used to have the Nike Revolution shoes that are black and white, but those... Those could those didn't work for me anymore. They got kind of torn up and just it was just time for some new ones. So I got these New Balance. I'm not sure what they're called. If I figure it out, I'll put it on screen for y'all. But they're very comfortable. They are white, so they do get dirty a little fast. You can see I have a little track skin mark right there. But overall, I really like these, and they also fit my insults in the inside, as you can see. But I really love these, and they're really cute and comfortable. So if you're looking for some running shoes. I suggest getting these. In this big compartment, we have my massage gun. And if you are a track athlete, you understand why I have this. It is very beneficial, I will tell you. Especially after you get them running a 400, if you're a 400 runner, I suggest you get one of these. Or if you're just trying to do a cool down or before you warm up, something like that, I suggest getting a massage gun. And mine has my name on it. But I got this off of Amazon and it comes with a bunch of different heads that you can add on there. Here's the bullet one and then whatever this one is. But I suggest getting one of these if you are a track athlete. My fielders and my jumpers, I suggest y'all get one too. Because honey, y'all muscles be having spasms and getting tired too. So you can use it also. Another thing I should add that I just thought about. If you don't have a massage gun you can use a foam roller it's just as good i promise also have an extra pair of socks in my bag because for some reason i always just can't remember to put extra socks in my bag All right, i move on to this next compartment if y'all are wondering what to put in your bag it feels like practice i'd suggest just like some workout clothes um if you're the type of person that loves to do ice baths i'd suggest another pair of clothes to do your ice bath in and like something you can put back on you know after your ice bath but that's what i put in my bag so when i go to practice i put some workout clothes in there maybe an extra pair of shorts and a t-shirt for my ice bath and then i put the clothes that i had on before back on after i drive and everything so that's what i would do if i were y'all on to the next compartment so lastly we have this long compartment right here on the side in here we have ibuprofen so some painkillers is what i keep over here and you never know when you might need these as an athlete your muscles get tired and they ache and they start to hurt so taking a few of these will get you right plus you'll never know when somebody else may need it too so it'd be nice if you were that person that'd be like okay i got some next up we have my arm sleeves so i have some in this packet my extra ones and then i have this one that i already have open so it just has my school logo on it and then the navy very stretchy some people put them on their legs but it's an arm sleeve so i keep it on my arm next are my snacks I always keep my snacks on me not gonna lie y'all i normally have more than this in here but i just had to put this in here for the video but yeah i always keep snacks especially these granola bars like you can't go wrong with no granola bars and some fruit snacks like never could go wrong but yeah these are cheese it's i normally probably have like goldfish or like a sports drink or a protein drink anything like that that's little and won't like give me like really full or make me burn out on energy i'll keep it in my bag oranges my team love oranges next we have these wet ones because you never know we might need to clean something up or spill something or waste something on yourself from your snack so i just keep these in there just to be clean these are my warm-up sheets so this is our short warm up. It just has it on there. This is a cool down slash warm down on here. And this is some sprints. If you're a sprinter, this is your warm up. So we got a bunch of warm up sheets just so like if a coach is not around and you're not sure like what you should be doing, we have these in our bags. Also, I have my stretch band so you just Put your foot up here and then you pull and stretch either way that you need to go it has little loops in here if you want to put your foot in there or something like that but this this right here is a lifesaver when you don't have someone to stretch you and you really need to stretch nobody's around to help you you can do it yourself with this right here i'm telling you it 
this I, it's a lightsaber but i think you can get this from like five below my coach actually bought this for me so pretty sure you can get it from like walmart or something like that next up we have my sunglasses now i'm not the athlete that has the vipers i'm the off brand i have a bunch of these i just ordered them off of amazon for like 20 dollars but this is my pink pair that i have in my bag right now this is what they look like and then put them on your face y'all can probably still see my eyes but i like the way they look so yeah love those all right y'all so that is it for the what's in my track bag video i hope y'all enjoyed and i hope i gave y'all some ideas or like a kind of a directional type thing of what you should have in your bag but that's it. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye!